guys, Billy Jenkins here with Silver Creek Doodles. Today we're headed back to Charlotte with a couple puppies. Who are we taking? All right, so you see our two puppies back here. That's not who we're taking to the airport. We've got Mr. Red from Katie's Litter. He is actually flying today. We're meeting our flight nanny. Um, she's wonderful. We've used her multiple times and I'll tag her information down below. But we're using our flight nanny and she is taking him to Seattle. So Mr. Red Collar from Katie's Litter is flying out. He's doing fantastic. So we actually didn't know until late last night that we were going to book this and get him out so quick. This is the first time he's been in this bag, but he's done really, really well. I'm super happy with how he's like, he's not made a peep. Like I put him in there and he laid down and he's not made a peep. So that's, I'm pretty happy. Um, of course he's used to a crate like this. So, you know, when you get him used to just being confined, just like these two, they don't, they don't fuss when they have to be put up. So that's good. And then we already had another family that lives right past Charlotte and Wax Hall that was wanting to come at like 2.30 today and meet these two puppies to pick one. Well, I'm like, if we're already going to Charlotte, might as well take these two, meet them and kind of, so they don't have to drive as far. So that worked out well. So we've got both greens, green from Eleanor's, right here, <laughs> other one, and then green from Charlie's Litter. So we got both green boys. Of course, the one from Charlie's Litter we've been training um, so we don't, that's the one that they're leaning towards, but I like for people to have an option. So we brought both of them so they can just play with them and get to see and stuff. So super excited to see which one they pick. So we got on the road this morning at, well, let's start with my alarm clock was set at five. So I went to bed after midnight, set my alarm for five. Of course I get up, you know, usually I would like to like try to sneak around and let my husband sleep, but I'm wake up we got some stuff to do <laughs> so thankfully we got up um you know i let puppies out fed them and then he went straight to bathing the three puppies which is really nice i don't know what um i would do without him because he was a huge help this morning i definitely could not get it done by myself so thanks Toby. you're welcome <laughs> um but yeah so definitely they're cleaned up looking good um ready to go but got up at five got on the road by like 6 10 it was too dark to start you know videoing before we left so just doing a little talking now of course we're pretty close to the airport what about like 15 minutes or so yeah ready to go All right, so first puppy is dropped off at the airport. Really glad to see how that's gonna go, so can't wait. And then we are just kind of right down the street and across the road at a family dollar park, like little strip mall. I don't know, we're gonna meet the other family here with these two puppies. We're gonna get them out, get them wiped up. There's a little bit of drool on and stuff like that from just a little bit of car sickness. But let's go ahead and get them out and get, get them cleaned up and then we'll meet the families in just a few minutes. Who, 